GTF Kisa What's good? Another day, another video. GTF was going on. GTF was going on. If you woke up this morning, you are blessed, Jerry. If you woke up this morning, you are most definitely blessed. GTF was good, man. Your boy on the road with it right now, man. We on the road with it. We ain't going too far. It seems like the gas crisis is getting a little better. I'm noticing that a lot more gas stations are starting to have fuel. I fueled up this morning, as a matter of fact. You understand me? I'm on full right now. You heard? We on full with it right now. Yeah, man. So it's looking like it's getting better. So hopefully next weekend we'll probably be able to take a trip. You feel me? Uh, within Florida, as usual. You know what I'm saying? Within Florida. But what's good though, man? I know some of y'all been wondering. I know some of y'all gonna ask about ZB. I tried to call that boy this morning because I noticed that the gas situation getting better. Um, but ZB on the way. You feel me? He told me he had to go to church with his baby mama again. You feel me? Uh -huh. Which is all good. You feel me? Can't get mad at that. You feel me? The man going to church with his baby mama. You feel me? That's a good thing. You heard? Don't you guys agree? It's a good thing. But yeah, man, we on the road with it right now. About to go get something to eat. It's about to be the afternoon. You understand me? Today is Sunday. We're feeling like getting some soul food. You understand me? So I was doing my research. You feel me? Searching through social media. Searching through social media. And come to find out, I never knew this, that Lamar Jackson, the NFL player Lamar Jackson from Florida, he got a restaurant down here. I'm like, what? I didn't know Lamar had a restaurant down here. Yeah. So I'm like, you know, I feel like giving me some soul food. I'm like, man, let's go to Lamar's spot because this is a soul food restaurant that they have. You feel me? Like, man, let's go to Lamar's spot real quick. Let's see what this food hitting for. I ain't even gonna cap with you, fam. We trying to see what this NFL player food hitting for, man. But yeah, man, we on the road with it, man. We gonna focus on this road. You feel me? We got a little trip ahead of us. We gonna wait to Pompano, Florida, which is about, you know what I mean? About 35, about 35 to 40 minutes from me. So, you know what I'm saying? We got a little trip. Uh, but yeah, man, that's what we hit. We on this road, and we gonna focus on this road. You understand me? Safety first. Let go. Right now. Turn right, then your destination will be on the left. Who we have with us now? Your destination is on the left. Oh, I see it right here. Alright, fam, let's go see what this soul food hitting for. Jackson restaurant, I ain't even gonna lie, it's nice in here, you heard? Got the menu on deck, you know what I'm saying? It's a lot of selections on here, let's check it out. You don't see the menu, fam? You think say so you ate yet? Right, check out the selections. I ain't gonna lie, it's a lot of stuff on here. Got your boy undecided, you heard? I ain't gonna lie to all the next time. 
one of the people that work here, what's the best thing on the menu to get? You know, they gave me a couple options or what have you, but I went with the um, turkey wings. Turkey wings with $14.99, comes with rice and two more sides. You understand me? It comes with rice. I mean, yeah, with rice and two more sides. I'm like, damn, and cornbread too for the um, $14.99. You understand me? I don't place my order already. Plus tax came out to 15 and 11. Yeah. 15 and 11. I ain't gonna lie, boy. I can't wait till that plate come out. All right, fam. We got the grub. You understand me, fam? I ain't gonna lie. For the 1508, this is a nice size plate. All right, fam. Like I said, man, for the 1508, this is a nice size plate. How I made that rhyme for the 1508. This is a nice size plate. I ain't gonna cap with y'all, fam. All right, fam. Time to set up Grub Tip Mobile Studios. Fam, I ain't gonna lie. For the 1511, that's a lot of food. That's a lot of food they gave me. They gave me, I got one big turkey wing. They came with rice. We had the choice of picking yellow rice, uh, rice and beans, and white rice, I think. I got the yellow rice because I always get rice and beans, so I'm going to try the yellow rice today. Um, What else? I got, they had a couple different sides. I got mac and cheese, and I got collard greens, yeah. Fam, I ain't gonna lie, that smell busting up out the bag right now, boy. Your boy can't wait to get to that plate right now, but I gotta clean my mask first. And, uh, yeah. Uh, it cost me 15 a lamb. 15 a lamb, yard. It's not a bad deal. It's a lot of food. Compared to the plate that I got the other day for the $22, and this for the 15 I ain't gonna lie, this plate went in all day. The last plate I got for the $22, it wasn't bad though, you feel me? It didn't taste bad or nothing. I'm just saying, as far as the amount of food, this plate right here for the 15 bucks, winning all day. And I ain't gonna lie, what's hot out there, dude? I feel that heat, bro. Man, I still got some streaks, but whatever. Don't see me clean it. Alright, fam. Let's get into this food. Gotta pull one for the GTF. Let's pop this thing. Oh, I found that close up action here. That turkey wing meal, man. That close up action from that plate from play action. You heard? Turkey wing meal comes with rice. Your choice of rice and two sides. I got yellow rice and the sides I got mac and cheese, collard greens. And what y'all think? What y'all think? I ain't gonna lie, for the 15 of them, I ain't got no complaints as far as the amount goes. The amount of food. Fam, I ain't gonna lie, your boy done calmed down, but I was just super duper mad not too long ago. I'll tell y'all in a minute. Let me get to this food. This the um that turkey wing here, turkey wing meal. Comes with rice and two sides. I got mac and cheese for the side. I got collard greens as a side. The rice I got yellow. I got a yellow rice. They had a uh, choice of getting white rice or rice and beans, but I wanted to get the yellow rice today. I ain't gonna lie, fam. It's some good food, and it's a lot of food for fifteen eleven. I ain't gonna cap with y'all. Yellow rice, hit that bit. Mm. Mm hmm. That yellow rice cooked the satisfaction, and with that gravy on there, make that thing. Oh. The flavor. I like me some good yellow rice. I ain't gonna cap y'all, man. I like me some good yellow rice. Mmm. Oh, by the way, in the short form video, I wasn't able to. I didn't have enough time. But they gave me. It came with cornbread too. I was. I didn't have enough time to shoot the cornbread. I ran out of time on the short form video. They got that cornbread. You gonna eat your cornbread? Mmm. Mm hmm. Another piece. That cornbread. Mmm. Mmm. 
Mm-hmm. Yeah, sir. Now, I ain't too crazy about everybody, collard greens. Let's try these. Collard green hit that bit. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Man, these collard greens outside. Mmm. These collard greens are flavored to the max. Once again, fam, this is from Lamar Jackson's restaurant. I ain't gonna lie, boy, they over there cook, cooking, boy. They got that play action in the, in the kitchen going on, boy. I don't know what kind of playbook playbook they running in the um. I don't know what kind of playbook they running in the kitchen, but this a touchdown, y'all. Touchdown going on. Collard green cooked to satisfaction and super duper flavored, flavor to the max. Publix ain't got nothing on this collard green, y'all. Shout out to Publix though. The mac and cheese. Fam, I ain't gonna lie, this mac and cheese is cheesy. Hit that beer. Oh my god. Damn. One of the best macaroni and cheese I've tasted so far in 2023. This thing here is right. Oh my god. You know what a trade that trade this mac and cheese and take it home. Wow. Fat mac and cheese killing it, fam. Best macaroni I've had so far. Macaroni and cheese I've had so far in 2023. I ain't gonna cap with y'all. Now I ain't gonna lie. I'm not big on turkey wings. I don't know for some reason. Like I like turkey, but you know, not the huge pieces of turkey like how you got with the turkey wing. Like it's cool. Like I don't hate it. I'll eat it, but I'm not big on it. But you know, the person. The guy that was there that was working at the catch register, he told me like turkey wings is one of the go-to meals there. So that's why I got it. You feel me? And I ain't want to get chicken wings because I know y'all always say, I, I'm always eating chicken wings, I ain't gonna lie. I ain't want to get a chicken wing. You feel me? I want to try something different for the GTF because the GTF always see me eating chicken wings. They always see me eating chicken wings. So I want to try something different. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, I don't hate turkey, but I'm not too crazy about the, you know, the big pieces of turkey. Like, this is a turkey wing. This is pretty huge, you but I got it for y'all. Hit that beer. Mmm. Whoever cooked this turkey wing. They most definitely know something. They most definitely know something. Hit that beer again. Mm-hmm. Yes, sir. If you like turkey wings, you, if you're crazy about turkey wings, you definitely gonna like this. This is huge and it tastes good. Huge piece of turkey wing and it tastes good. The flavor is most definitely there. And it's cooked to satisfaction. It's, 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 well, it's cooked well. And the flavor is most definitely there. Get back to the mac and cheese, though. Mac and cheese, hit that bit. Collard greens, again, hit that bit. Mmm. This plate got so much flavor. I ain't even gonna cap with y'all. And I ain't gonna lie, 15, 11, this is a big plate. Your boy stuff. It's currently two something in the afternoon. I might be done eating for the day. I'm stuffed right now. I ain't even finished the food. Well, yeah, fam, what I want to talk to y'all about today, man. This is your chance to exit. If y'all want to hear me talk about the TV show. <clears throat> fam, your boy want to lay down right now, you heard? That's the thing about eating good food, dog. Make you want to lay down. Which is not really good for you to go lay down after eating. <sighs> but
But yeah, what I want to talk about today was uh, Power Book 2 Ghost. I saw the latest episode last night. Here's your chance to exit if you don't want to hear if you didn't see the episode. You want me to spoil it for you? But basically, in this episode, found what happened? Oh, yeah, Monet's son. Monet, not Kane, the other son. He decided that he wanted to get revenge for his daddy. For some reason, I don't know where he got it from. I'm still thinking, I'm trying to figure that out. I think I forgot or I missed something. But for some reason, he thinks the Russians are the one that killed his dad. So he went and got revenge on the Russians. He killed somebody from the Russian side, basically for nothing. Because the Russians did not kill his dad. His mom was the one that had the dad killed. Monet. So somebody from the Russian side died for nothing. So now, meanwhile, at the funeral for their father, the Russians pull up. You feel me? With guns blazing at the funeral. So now it's like a war going on. It's crazy right now. It's crazy right now. And Tariq, he found out from the previous episode, you know, because he spoke to Lauren. Lauren is alive. So Lauren told him that was Effie that tried to kill her. So now Tariq confronts Effie in this ep recent episode. Effie, who was Tariq's current girlfriend. Tariq takes her, takes her to the site and confronts her. Tell me the truth, whatever. I'm not stupid, all that. So she finally tells Tariq the truth. Oh, I did it to save you, da 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 whatever. Now basically Tariq done cut off. He's mad, he's pissed. He told her, find your own way home. So he let her walk home, whatever. She took a, a ride share program, I don't know. But he left out in the middle of nowhere. Anyway, by the time they get back to the place, well, Tariq had to confront Brayden too, because Brayden had something to do with it too. So now Tariq cut, cut off Brayden and Effie from the, from, from the, from the, from the dope dealing business. And uh, Kane met up with Brayden and told Brayden, oh, you need to man up. How he gonna just cut you out of the, the business? You need to man up. Basically, that's what he told him. So now, what his name? Um, Braden. Braden went and, you know, he cut Tariq access off to get inside inside the uh, the, the building. What's the building? His, 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 his family's building. I forgot the, the, the name of the building. The Western building, I think it is. He cuts off his access or whatever in hoping that Tariq gonna say, okay, I'll let you back into the business, but Tariq wasn't with it. But anyway, Tariq is done with Effie, so now Tariq, Goes and sees uh, Monet's daughter, Diana. Meanwhile, Diana's beefing with her new dude. The new dude from the schoolhouse, from the college or whatever. So now Tariq goes to see Diana. And they end up knocking the boots. So meanwhile, while they knocking up, knocking, after they done knocked the boots, the next morning, Effie comes over to talk to Diana. About helping her, you know, move some weight or what have you. And come to find out Tariq is there. So now Effie is pissed. You feel me? It's crazy. I feel, oh, it's, it's, it's crazy right now. It's crazy, but this is definitely a good episode. It's crazy right now. Um, what else happened? Oh, yeah, Sax them. Sax and that lady, his lawyer, the lawyer girl who he's infatuated with, you know, she threatened Sax. Basically, if you didn't help me, I would expose you. Da 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 da. This, that, and the third. You understand me? So, Sax, is, Sax basically got to help her. And Sax met up with Lauren to talk about the whole Tariq thing. Um,. It's just crazy right now, fam. It's just crazy. If you saw the episode, man, let me know. Drop them comments. Let me know what you think. It's crazy right now. Crazy right now. You feel me? Uh, I can't wait to the next episode. And then uh, what, did, what did Tariq do? Tariq um, helped his grandma. So the gra uh, he helped his grandma go be with uh, go be with his mom and, and the daughter. So, and then he told the grandma, you know, tell mom, you know, I'll get there. You know, he basically he's trying to get, find a way to get to them so they can all be together. So that's the plan, fam. So that's what we're seeing right now. Definitely a good episode. I love Power Year. I can't wait to the next episode. Fam, I gotta take off. Gotta the same things. Go take care of, man. Appreciate y'all for tuning in. Yeah. GTF for life. Make sure y'all check out Play Action Cafe for that food. I tried to if you like turkey wings, you'll definitely like this meal. I'm not too crazy about turkey wings, but the, the turkey wings was definitely good. I'm not crazy about turkey wings. I just didn't want to get chicken wings because y'all always see me eating chicken wings. I want to try something different. So I got the turkey wing dinner. The flavors most definitely there. Definitely taste good. All that. The rice was good. The collard greens was good. The mac and cheese was good. The cornbread was good. All that was good. A lot of food for the 1511. I ain't going to cap with you, y'all. GTF for life.